Hey guys, well it's Bank Holiday Monday and it's also April Fool's Day. It's just a quick, kind of fun video from me to ask you this question, who did it better? So on daytime TV, that bastion of brilliance today, we had two shows do pranks on the presenters. We had Good Morning Britain and then we had This Morning. Now, have a look at this. This is Good Morning Britain in which Charlotte Hawkins is led to believe she's putting on pearls that were given to Marilyn Monroe by the baseball player Joe DiMaggio. And she's told they're worth £700,000. So look how this goes down. To touch the pearls. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> I touch them, don't worry. Should I just pull? That was once around Marilyn Monroe's chops. Oh, my God. You can just lift your hair for me, Charlotte. Right, gotcha. So delicate. And just a little bit at the back cool. for me. Oh, sorry. That's fine. Just <laughs> how, how, it's, how it's sitting. Wouldn't it be awful if they unthreaded? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Richard! Oh, my... You made that happen! No! Oh, oh, I don't believe that happened. Can I just confirm you have okay. it on camera? I was not touching that at the time. Did you... Did you is this... It, no, it... Uh, oh... I'm so sorry. Um, here you are. Can I give you these? I'm sure whoever owns this necklace, Yo. I've got quite a lot of them here. <laughs> this has got to be an April Fool. Here, they're all falling If this, this has to be April Fool's, it has, has to be. This has to be an April Fool. Or maybe it's a prank at work. Is this your April Fool? No, 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 no. It's not my April Fool. I really hope it is, because otherwise um, I've sort of been a part of um, damaging a very expensive necklace. Um, we'll take a pause there, sir, shall we? <gasps> All right. Um, we go we're going to break. Oh, well, we have a little um, look around to see if we can. I can't think this is an April Fool, but it's not. It was extraordinary coincidental piece out. of television. Like, the pearls are tough. Pearls, are, it's okay. Pearls are tough. They can be refreaded. Still to come. Singapore. Now, I actually thought that was pretty good. I don't know whether Richard Madeley was in on it. I suspect ZZ was. I thought that was pretty good uh, acting there. And I think it did actually catch Charlotte by surprise. The second example we have is Alison Hammond and Dermot O'Leary on This Morning. You may have seen this one. Now, a lady brought a vase into the studio. This is rather well set up by Dermot, I have to say. A vase she said she paid £1.50 for, but is actually worth £30,000, according to antique experts. And you can pretty much guess what's going to happen. But that would be our tell sign. Wow. I, I bet you're really upset that you're not in the studio today, aren't you? I'm gutted. I tried to get a flight back, but it's Easter weekend. There's no way I could get back. I, I would have paid thousands to have got back, but unfortunately, oh. I can have be free. Wow. Brilliant. Well, thanks, Dan. Thanks, The Dan. thing is out. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm so... so... Are you actually joking, Dan? No. I'm so... I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'll pay for it. I promise I'll pay for it. I'm so, so... <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I, I, I'm actually going to get upset. I'm so, so sorry. Babes, I'm so sorry. Oh, I think this has happened. I'm so sorry. I'll pay for it. I'm so sorry, everybody. I mean, I've only got one thing to say, which is April Fools! <laughs> so who did it better? If you want my opinion, and I'm sure you don't, so I'm going to give it to you anyway. I actually think it was Good Morning Britain. Because... I just had a whiff of suspicion that Alison kind of knew something was up. And that may be because Alison's just good at ascertaining when things are perhaps a little bit off. Or maybe because she was briefed beforehand. But of the two, I thought GMB won that. Hands down, actually. Vases down. Pearls down. Yes. So let me know what you think in the comments. I hope this video stays up because... I've actually shown you the clips and sometimes I don't like that. But thanks for watching, guys, and happy April Fool's Day. This has been Louis Walsh bringing you this superb video, which is just banter.